Well, this year, the safety of American moms in delivery rooms has been in the national headlines. CDC reports show a sharp increase in maternal deaths. The video you're about to see is a simulation show, so it's not a real patient. But as morning anchor Kirsten O'Connor shows us, new technology in Orlando will be helping moms in the delivery room. People think that everybody just comes in, has a baby, and has a happy ending. The first product that's really looked at maternal mortality. This is Triton, an artificial intelligence system for nurses to measure blood loss. According to the CDC, the rate of maternal deaths in the U.S. is climbing. And with 14,000 deliveries a year, Winnie Palmer Hospital is the first in the country to try new technology to get results. Every time you get the beep, it has now broken down that image pixel by pixel using that facial recognition-like technology to identify grams of hemoglobin and convert it to the blood loss for that particular sponge. Prior to this technology, it was manual. So they would have to literally stop what they were doing, m measure things on a scale, weigh them, subtract things out, and it was time consuming. Lorraine Parker says 150 OB nurses are training to use Triton alongside Jack Kropolak. We are helping identify um, moms that have had excessive bleeding. And the reason I got involved here is because my wife experienced postpartum hemorrhage um, when we had our twin boys five years ago. Groblack says watching his wife trying to adapt as a new mom while recovering herself brought him here. So being able to help recognize and allow people to have early intervention um, means a lot to me personally. And this is the first product that's really been geared towards helping moms have a better outcome. This AI technology is part of a $1 million investment from Orlando Health to bring new technology for patient care. Getting results for your health. Kirsten O'Connor, News 6. Wow, I don't fully understand all that's going on there. But no, but it is so necessary and that technology being developed right here in Central Florida as always yep. on the cutting edge of things. Amazing.